Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your favorite geeking poetic podcast, Dorks. <laughs> I'm Larry. I'm Vito. And I'm Megan. And uh, we just wanted to say Happy New Year. That's not so happy, is it? <laughs> no, it's pretty much the same <laughs> but shit. But we are going to make it happy. <laughs> We're going to try anyway. Yeah, we haven't talked to you guys like this in a while. It's been a while since we've reached out on social media and stuff. It just told everybody what's up with us um we have all sorts of stuff planned for 2021 i mean we're going to do a lot of the same stuff you've come to know and love (laughs) from gigging poetic but we've got a bunch of stuff that uh is new and then a lot of things that we're tweaking that we kind of changed right Mm -hmm. put a twist on some stuff yeah a little twist what a twist all these twists on things. Uh, first of all, one of the things that we did a little twist on that you'll be seeing very soon is our trivia torture segment. Now, a bunch. No, you guys love trivia torture. Yeah, a trivia torture seems to be one of the most popular things we do because people like to see us make asses out of ourselves. They like to see the faces that we all make. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but you know. We've enjoyed doing it, but it's always been a little bit ramshackle when we've done it. It's The format is very loosey-goosey, as they would say. Uh, but we decided, well, we love game shows, and we love doing the trivia stuff. Let's just go full-on corny-ass game show, right? So we have created the all-new, all-geeky <laughs> trivia torture game show. And uh, man, we put a lot of effort into it. We put, we built props. Mm-hmm. We've got all sorts of silly, silly stuff that we did to make it more like an old school crusty game show. <laughs> and I mean, we're still going to be doing the to- the trivia and everything. It's still going to be answering trivia, but we've added some new categories to it. We've expanded it a little bit, and we've made the torture part just a little bit different. So if you like to see people get tortured. Don't worry. It's still going to happen. And by torture, obviously, we're not talking about like, you know. Waterboarding. And yeah, put them in the <laughs> Iron Maiden. <laughs> you know, so excellent. But anyway, it's not anything like that. It's obviously like we did before where it's like you have to drink some nasty booze that tastes really awful, like my lord. Yeah. Or you have to eat like horrible booger tasting like jelly beans and oh, just all oh, the silly dead fish smelling things and stuff yeah it's making us wretch <laughs> just thinking about it those sodas remember that awful oh, soda yeah. <laughs> Vito almost totally blew it yeah it was bad <laughs> <laughs> so we're still going to be doing that but we put a little bit of a different spin on it so that uh, it's kind of like if you're the grand loser <laughs> at the end of the show you're the one that really has to uh, pay the price and how you choose that well we're going to leave some things a surprise until the episode comes out but yeah we're really excited about the new trivia torture I think it's a lot of fun yeah a lot of fun <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> for some people yeah megan's like yeah you keep saying that because you were the host of it and everything yeah yeah a blast can't, <laughs> can't wait for more <laughs> well we're gonna take turns being the host <laughs> we each get to be wink martindale you know or bert convey or one of those people nobody can be alex trebek there is there is only one that can be only one trebek <laughs> What we are missing from our game show, in case anybody sees it out there for us, let us know. We need that really skinny... Bob Barker microphone. Bob Barker yes. microphone. Yeah. Yeah, that is what is missing from our show. <laughs> yeah, it's not quite the same without having that microphone. Yeah, so. so we've changed that up, and that's going to be coming out really soon. Another thing that we have uh, changed a little bit is people love when we do our top five every month almost every month we do a top five and we always did it on a different subject you know recently we did it about holiday movies that were our favorites and we've done it over horror movies or certain actors or franchises well we came up with something a little bit different uh leading up to the anniversary of the show which is in may it'll be three years three years we've been doing this bullshit (laughs) but we love doing it and we thank you for sticking with us for those that have but we thought we'd do something a little different we are actually not going to do a top five we're not going to do a top 10 we are doing a top 20 
And not only a top 20, we're doing the top 20 favorite films of all time for each one of us. Not necessarily what's the most popular of all time or the biggest money makers or what you people think. It's just about us. And anybody that knows us. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, boy. (laughs) Yeah, knows that this is going to be a pretty mixed bag of results here because we have very different tastes in a lot of ways. If you're already going, oh, my God, a top 20 video. and These guys talk so long as it is. (laughs) That thing's going to be like five hours long. No, what we're going to do is we're going to, starting at the end of January, we're going to release them in batches of five. So at the end of January, you will see top 20 through 16. February, we'll do 15 through 11. March will be 10 through 6. And then finally in April, we will do the big top five. And uh, then that will lead up to May, which is the anniversary and uh what we're gonna do then well we're gonna leave you we're gonna leave you guessing for that but i'm pretty excited a little befuddled man trying to do a top 20 list is really hard really hard especially when you sometimes there's a comfort in having it narrowed down to a specific category and stuff but this is just across the board yeah yeah I, i had a hard time putting them in order yeah especially because it can change. It keeps changing. Vito, I don't think you've even done yours yet, have you? Dude, I'll put a bunch on there, and I'm like, oh, I think I got it, and then I'll remember, oh, but wait, I forgot about these seven other movies that belong on this list. So it's yeah. like, well, shit, now what am I going to do? <laughs> yep. Yeah, so putting them in order is a whole different task. That's going to take you me like a made week. It that no, I haven't even got that far yet. <laughs> yeah. So what we're putting out there to you is not only to expect and anticipate this top 20 list of ours, of our favorite films of all time, but we want you to post in the Geeking Squad or you can post on the Geeking Poetic Facebook page. Let us know what would be your top 20 favorite films of all time. I bet it's going to be harder than you think it is. (laughs) Because some of you are probably like, oh yeah, I I know I'm going to add this and I'm going to add this. Sit down and try and make that list, mofos, because (laughs) it is harder (laughs) than you expect. But we're going to start recording this in a matter of days. So uh, let us know your thoughts. I Hopefully this starts rolling out quickly and everything. And we will talk about your choices, especially if any of them click with our choices and stuff. And, you know, who knows? Maybe at the end of it, maybe somebody will get a prize. We've been known to give away prizes before, so... Somebody puts together like the best list, the most perfect geeking poetic top 20 list. Maybe somebody that makes a good combination of the best of all three of our lists. Yeah, maybe you'll get some sort of prize, right? Meg's got all kinds of prizes up her sleeve. I do. Yeah. That's amongst some of the cool new stuff we've got coming out. And then last but not least right now, the biggest thing that we're going to have a big announcement and reveal for in just a matter of a couple of weeks here is that we are going to do an offshoot, a sister channel of sorts, or brother channel, or whatever. Say what? Siamese twin channel of some sort. We're going to do another channel. And what is this channel going to focus on? I don't know. Uh, Maybe music? Since we promised it from day one and we haven't (laughs) delivered? Exactly. About freaking time. (laughs) I mean, like, not like Vito and I know anything about music. (laughs) Not really. No, it doesn't revolve around your entire <laughs> livelihood. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. And Meg's a big music fan as well. Mm-hmm. So we, we ever since the very, very first little teaser commercial video thing we made three years ago, we had said, we're going to get into all kinds of music. And then we've pretty much not. <laughs> and the reason being is because there's just not enough space on this channel as it is. And trying to fit it in with all our other kooky stuff that we do it's it's just difficult so we decided we're going to do another channel where we talk about nothing but music stuff and it's going to have all different kinds of things there could be interviews there could be you know retrospectives there could be actual playthrough things because again we got musicians here (laughs) Vito likes his playthrough stuff I sure do he likes being able to (laughs) He likes being able to play his Weedle Weedle on his guitar, you know, and everything. So there's going to be all sorts of stuff. Uh, The name of the channel and the more specifics about it, you're going to have to check back because we are going to have a big announcement and reveal very soon. But again, on that note, you know, go, oh, 
Larry and Vito and Megan are finally going to talk about music stuff. I want them to talk about what you need to let us know again, leave comments because we have plenty of our our own ideas. Don't get me wrong, (laughs) but we want to know what you all want to hear us talk about and feature. I mean, do you want to hear us talk about stuff that has to do with our own music? I don't know why, because it's probably because I think that shit's boring. But if you want to hear us talk about our own music, our own bands, we'll do some of that. If you want us to feature other bands or other genres or specific thing, anything, if you have any ideas, let us know because we're people pleasers. What can I tell you? We want to, you know, we just want to make it fun for everybody. It's our, we already know it's going to be fun for us. Oh, yeah. So with that, I mean, that's about it. That's enough. That's a lot. Yeah. We've, we've, we've given you enough teasers here of what's to come, but we just wanted to put it out there to let you know that we're here and we're not going anywhere. And we are going to be putting out all sorts of really cool stuff very soon, along with the normal stuff. Still doing the Geeking Squad. We might start doing the Geeking Squad weekly. Let Ooh, us, yeah, that's let us news flash. Right, let us know if you are happy about that, or if you're like, oh God, no, please don't. But uh, <laughs> and if you say no, well, too too bad, too, too bad, because too bad. I think we're going to do it anyway. Because we just have so much to talk about for all of you in the Geeking Squad that like to post stuff and share your articles. Keep doing that; it's awesome. Uh, it's what helps us to keep the Geeking Squad podcast going. So we will be back to motor mouth at you soon with all the new stuff. It's exciting. We're going to try to make 2021 awesome. It's going to fight back, but we're trying. (laughs) We'll fight back just as hard. (laughs) Exactly. So we'll see you soon on the flip side. Bye. Toodles.